Hello, I'm historian Richard Offen, and I'm standing outside Miller's Bakehouse. The history of bread in Western Australia is quite interesting. The Aboriginal people, the Wajuk Noongar tribe, baked bread many thousands of years ago using seeds they gathered from the bush. Following colonisation by the British in 1829, the first bakery opened on land just behind where the Palace Hotel is now on St George's Terrace, and that was run by the Oakley brothers. This bakehouse was started by H. Miller and Son in 1935. The building was built at a cost of, wait for it, £720. I don't think you could buy a bread bin for that these days. And they started to bake bread for the local community. The bread was delivered by horse and cart. During the war, the manpower services designated areas, zones, for each baker to use. And millers were the sole providers for this area. After the war, competition from much bigger bakers began to hit home. And by the 1960s, sadly, this company couldn't compete with sliced bread and mass production of baking. And it closed. In 1988, as part of the bicentennial celebrations, the city of Melville restored this building and turned it into the old Bakehouse Museum. Inside, you can see a history of baking in Western Australia.